Hello, my poor friends. <laughs> I would like to thank everyone who has subscribed to my fledgling channel. And a big thank you goes to two people in particular, Nilda Rodriguez and Gina DeLuca, both who have been extremely encouraging, supportive, and helpful in my pouring and YouTube adventure. <laughs> so thank you both so much. I've also learned that people like short videos, so let's get to it. <laughs> Today I'm going to be doing another ring and ribbon pour using the Artist Loft Ready Mix paints because it's so much fun. I'm just absolutely taken with them. But I don't want you to get bored with my videos, so I'll take a break from them after this one and maybe do this type of thing. It's kind of a Dutch pour, I guess you call it, with these paints. If you're interested, maybe leave a comment and um, I'll see what I can do. So without further ado, let's get to it. I'll put the colors. I, I've already loaded up the cup because again, there's no mixing involved. These are ready made. I'll put the colors I used. Um, I'll try to remember the order I put them in in the uh, description below. And here we go. Start with a straight pour. Maybe do a little ring action. A little jiggle. I'm shaking a little bit. I'm hungry. <laughs> More. Oh, I like it. The white finally came out. I love the orange and turquoise together. I hope that will come through. Where's the orange? I once read Orange is the color of, of insanity, but it's one of my favorite colors, so hmm. not sure what that says about me. There it is. Come on. Be bold. Oh, I wanted it brighter than that. Hopefully the next appearance of it. Maybe a little jiggle. Okay, I'm almost at the end. I better do my ribbon thing. Here we go. Have a little bit left in the cup for her additions if necessary. Oh, look at that beautiful orange way over there. I'm going to probably lose it. Um, well, let me start tilting. Oh, but then I like the ribbon over here. What to do? There's some orange left in there. I wonder if it'll come out if I just run it right across the center. Let's give that a try. Not very bright, turned a little muddy. I know what I'll do. I'll add some to the cup now, what's left in there. Some fresh orange. Cover up some of these drizzles I don't like, like this one. This Looks good now. How will it look when I stretch it though? That remains to be seen. Let's give it a go. Hmm. 
love using complementary colors side by side if they don't mix. They really stand out. Oh, I got some real gray over there. Why is that? Eh, let's get rid of it. I'll just tilt that away. Let me add some more. Why is it gray? I'm not sure. Oops. Um, this isn't very pretty. Let's cover that up. I don't like that. Add a little white to <laughs> Well, let's stretch. I'm going to get rid of that. <clears throat> Dull, I, I can't quite figure out where that came from. So it's going away. I don't want to lose, now I'm going to lose my orange that I added. But we know how to fix that. Hmm. I rather like it. I like some more orange, though. What do I have in the cup? I've got mostly white. Now I'm getting muddy blue. I'm going to get a new cup. Orange just is not coming through. I don't want to put straight orange on there, but maybe I need to. Am I too hung up on the orange? I gotta do it. I like it. I don't know that I want to do much else to it. I think it looks pretty good. Should probably stop. I think it's pretty wonderful. Uh, okay, so the lesson today is that you don't have to be satisfied with what's in the cup, quickly grab some more and add, add to it. Hmm. Okay, well, I don't normally worry about the 
corners because I frame this, this type. But since I have a little in the cup, let's let's do it. That corner was a little bit uh, too exposed. Ah. No, no. Leave it alone. Leave it alone. Stop, stop, stop. Okay, folks. I think that's it. Um, let me take the canvas up and give you a close-up. What do you think? It's fun. It's different. I think we'll call that a... Hmm, maybe a on, a... on a scale of A to F, I'll call it a B. Sorry about that big glare. I don't know. I'm not good at lighting. There, that's a little better. Okay, um, I'm calling this done. Thanks for joining me. See you next time. Bye-bye.